If I had a catchphrase, then I think my catchphrase would be the following catchphrase. I haven't got a catchphrase. That would be my catchphrase. Still, it's nowhere near as cool as all the ones I knew at school and all the ones I've learned since then. Oh, no, what were they again? There's simply E as from the Fonz and the famous one from the two Rons. It's good night from me, good night from him. There's I'll be back and damn it, Jim. No, don't chitter and go on. Let's see what you would have won. Nice to see you, see you nice. Good use of the same word twice as you behave and there's I'm free. Yabba dabba do but me, I haven't got a catchphrase. But if I had a catchphrase, then I think my catchphrase would be the following catchphrase. I haven't got a catchphrase. That would be my catchphrase. Now, apparently the linguists, the linguists, why are they called linguists? Surely they should be called linguists. It's weird, that. Must be some body of experts that could explain why that is. But anyway, the linguists have apparently had a massive argument between themselves. Split right down the middle there. It's all over the pronunciation of one little word. Half of them think it should be pronounced schism, and the other half think it should be pronounced schism. <laughs> now, I would explain why that's a very good joke, but unfortunately there's no time due to the fact that apparently there's a second verse of the catchphrase song. Here we go. You're doomed, you're doomed, and just like that. I turn, I turn, a bunny tat. Silly moo, and only me. I pity the fool from Mr. T. Lovely jubbly cowabunga, heidi hi, and I can remember. Matron from our cat, and also turn our nice again. Mmm, Betty, what's up, Jack? And something camp from that blow gock. I don't believe it. That's a high. It can't be beaten, and that is why. He hasn't got a catchphrase, but if he had a catchphrase, then we think his catchphrase would be the following catchphrase. I haven't got a catchphrase. That would be his catchphrase.